Hey guys, welcome back to the Gamer Play. I'm Dave the Usher. The game we're playing is Mario Bros. for the Atari 5200. And this game is brought to you by GameAnyone.com. Awesome stuff, man. That's right. We're stepping it up, man. We're moving up on the Mario chain. We're now at the Atari 5200 version. Now, as you may know, Mario Bros. is an arcade game published and developed by Nintendo in 1983. It is a follow-up to Donkey Kong and stars Mario, a plumber who was previously named Jumpman. To date, Mario Bros. has been re-released more than 20 times across more than a dozen platforms. Good stuff. In this game, Mario is portrayed as an Italian-American plumber. How you doing? Who, alongside his brother Luigi, has to defeat creatures that have been coming up from the sewers below New York. The gameplay focuses on Mario's extermination of pests in the sewers by flipping them on their backs and kicking them away. The original versions of Mario Bros., the arcade version, and the Nintendo version received positive receptions. Uh, in Japan, the Nintendo version of Mario Bros. sold more than 1.63 million copies. Okay, let's talk about the, uh, the enemies in this game. We got Shell Creepers, Sidesteppers, and Fighter Flies. Oh my, man. Awesome stuff. Those are the main enemies, anyway. Another enemy called Slip Ice has the ability to melt down and freeze a platform it is on. We probably all know what that's about. And it makes it uh, more difficult for the player to move around and the character kind of slips around the, the uh, pipes. There's also two types of fireballs. There's red ones that bounce around and green ones that will chase you if you become idle for more than a couple of seconds. Awesome stuff. This game was uh, ported to the Apple II, Atari 2600, of course, the Atari 7800, Atari 8-bit computers, the Amstrad CPC, Sinclair Spectrum, and Commodore 64, not to mention countless others. The, uh, the last system had two versions, the Atari Soft Port released in 1984, and a version by Ocean Software in 1986. Awesome. Let's play. Oof. Mario the Carpenter and his brother Luigi are hopping mad, man. The water pipes in their houses are blocked with pesky crawling creatures. If the two brothers can't get rid of them all, they'll never take a bath again. Nope. Oh. Not good. Okay. So, okay, this is the, uh, this is the Atari, uh, 5200 version. What do you think of the graphics? An upgrade? An upgrade from the 2600 version, don't you think? But I don't know, man. Doesn't everything look a little kind of boring and greenish-yellow, like... Like, oh, sh well, that was close. Like a Game Boy game, you know? You know what I'm saying? A Game Boy game. The controls are, uh... Fucking fireball! Oh! Backwards jump! Oh, Jesus. You know, I really don't want to die on the first stage, but right now, things are getting really crazy. I don't even know what's going on right now. Oh, fireballs! So yeah, right off the bat, these fireballs will come if you're idle. Usually, sometimes in uh, the first early stages of uh, the Mario Bros. levels, they don't come right away if you're idle. Only the one version of the fireball will show up, the red one. Can't really tell in this version, can you? I mean, I don't know what the hell colors these are supposed to be. Usually they're supposed to be like red and bluish greenish. But, uh, I mean, graphics-wise, yeah, it's an upgrade. It's an upgrade from the, uh, 26, uh, 2600 version. I mean, how can it not be? Mario kind of looks a little more like Mario. The turtles look more like turtles. God, Mario really looks more like Mario. Uh, you know, the, uh, the pipelines look nicer. The, uh, the POW block. I just don't know why everything's in just boring green. Considering everything, it's kind of a little bit of a disappointment. Oh shit, I missed. I'm, I missed him. Here comes these fireballs, man. Jesus. Okay. Gotcha. Oh, oh no, oh no! Just like the uh, Atari 2600 uh, version, the controls are a little sloppy. You gotta get used to the uh, delay. And just like the uh, 2600 version, when you complete a level, there's actually like one or two seconds when you can still move around and like something actually could end up killing you. I'd call that a flaw. How much time do I got? I think I can do this. Ah! Four, three, oh no! I'm not gonna make it! I'm not gonna make Oh! I messed up. One step. That's all it takes. Okay, so we're up to the crabs now. You gotta hit these, uh, 
Gotta hit these guys twice to knock them over fully. Oh, oh god, I thought he was gonna turn about. He didn't, he tricked me. Red coins, of course, give you points. Get enough points and get an extra life. Ah. What I like about Mario Bros, the arcade version, is that if you knock them on the edge of a platform, it'll, like, kind of send them off to the sides, to the right. It should have went. I don't know, in this version, it's not really clear on, uh... It's not really clear on that. I don't know, it's tough to explain. Oh, no! <laughs> hey, that's a nice touch. I, uh, I was unaware of that. When Mario got hit by the fireball, he was kind of like, Ah! I'm burning alive! And there's Mario, and whenever you die, you start off uh, in the upper top middle. There's supposed to be a platform under Mario's feet, but I don't see it. It's a little weird, don't you think? Where's the platform? Okay, there we go. Crab looks pissed off. Okay, let's finish this. There you go. Whew. Awesome. So just like in all the Mario games, man, you make your way up. The turtles, the crabs, the fighter flies. Let's let him turn. There we go. Oh boy, this is gonna get messy. This is gonna get messy. Uh. Okay, ready? Check this out. That knocked a lot of them down. Oh, that's bullshit. You're supposed to be able to jump over the enemies. You gotta time it right, but it's very doable. I thought I got a little jip there. I, f I feel a little cheated. That's bullshit. Alright, I'll try again. Okay, there we go. I did it that time. You can also jump the fireballs, but in my opinion, I think it's always harder. Whoa! Oh! Oh! God, look at that. He, like, doubled back. You're supposed to, when an enemy encounters uh, another enemy, or, like, a fireball or something else, and they walk into it, they're supposed to, you know, turn around and go the other way. And they do, but sometimes they kind of fake you out. I don't know what's up with that. Okay, one more turtle. Let's go, asshole. And of course, when there's only one enemy left, that enemy will walk, or jump, or crawl, a little bit faster. Okay, I'm up to the fighter flies. In the arcade version, when you uh, advance to uh, newer levels that have newer enemies, it lets you know, but I guess not in this one. Oh, I think that's a little lame. Okay, red coins. I think you get uh, more lives in this Mario uh, this Mario uh, Brothers version. If you look in the uh, upper left-hand side, you can see Mario. It says three. Those are my lives. What did I start out with? Five? I don't even know. Hey, you're supposed to... I guess he jumped over him. Oh, shit. That's not good. All right, let's go. Come on, move it. Get out of the way. So basically... Each time you play a different version of Mario Bros, you have to get used to the controls and uh, and the uh, the strategy. I'm pretty good in uh, Mario Bros, the arcade game. Okay, I got none of them. Good good job there. Good stuff. Come on! Ah, uh, here we go. Jumped over him. Hurry up! Go back! Mario, what do you think about this? Oh, shit. Oh, I thought I nailed him. These fireballs, man, let me tell you. The fireballs are the biggest pain in the ass in this game. They don't look like they uh, give them different colors. There seems to be only a couple of main colors in this game. The only thing that's really colored and detailed is Mario himself. Look at that. Everything else is bland, boring... Damn this guy. Oh! Okay, we gotta get this guy. Oh, shit. Delayed controls. Tried to go back. I'm losing all my lives, man. Oh, Jesus. Okay. Hurry up. Hurry up. We gotta get him. We can do it. Gotcha. Finally. Phew. Hey, now. Grabs. Don't do it! 
Oh, oh no! Son of a bitch. So I got a zero life. They gave me a zero life in this game. I don't think I'm going to be able to pull out this level without dying once more. That is a lot of shit, man. That is a lot of shit. Hopefully I can get up to the slip ice part of this game. It's probably coming up in a level or two. Okay, fireball. Fireball to the left and right. That's not a good place to be. Whoa! Look at that. Look how one goes down there, one goes up. Here comes another. Damn. Jump, Dave! Go back! Oh, no! Oh! <laughs> Backwards jump! And my hair is on fire, and I'm dead. Bah! Anyway, guys, I want to thank you all for watching. I'm Dave the Usher for The Gamer Play. Stay tuned for the next part of Mario Bros. I'll see you guys next time. I am out.